Now, never there was a time when I did not exist, nor you, nor these people. Now, he analytically says, I, you, and first person, second person, and third person. That is complete. I, you, and other. So, Krishna says, never there was a time when I, you, and all these persons who have assembled in this battlefield uh, did not exist. That means in the past, I, you, and all of them, they individually existed. Individually. The Mayavadi theory is that the ultimate spirit is impersonal then how Krishna can say that never there was a time when I, you, and all these persons uh, uh, never existed. That means I existed as individual, you existed as individual, and all these persons who are before us, they also existed as individuals. Uh, never there was a time. Now, uh, what is your uh, answer, Dinda? Krishna says, never we were mixed up. We are all individuals. And he said, never we shall remain, uh, never there will be time when we shall not exist. That means in the past we existed as individuals. In the present there is no doubt we are existing as individuals. And in the future also we shall continue to remain as individuals. Then when the impersonal conception comes at all, in the past, present, future, there are three times. Huh? And all the times we are individuals. Then when God becomes impersonal or I become impersonal, you become impersonal. Where is the chance? Now Krishna clearly says, and there was never a time when I, you, and all these uh, individual uh, kings or soldiers, hmm, and that, that there is not that, that we did not exist in the past. So in the past we existed as individuals, and the present there is no doubt we are existing as individuals. You are my disciple, I am your spiritual master, but you have got his individuality, I have got my individual. If you don't agree with me, you can leave me. That is your individuality. So, if you don't like Krishna, you cannot become in Krishna consciousness. That is an individuality. So this individuality continues. Similarly, 
Krishna, if he does not like you, he may refuse you, Krishna consciousness. Not that because you are following all the rules and regulations and Krishna is obliged to accept you. No. If he thinks that he is nonsense, I cannot accept him. He will reject you. So he has got individuality, you have got individuality, everyone has got individuality. Where is the question of impersonalism come? There is no possibility. And if you don't believe Krishna, you don't believe uh, Vedas, apart from anything else, Krishna is accepted in supreme authority, the personality of Godhead, then if you don't believe Him, then where is the possibility of advancing in knowledge? There is no possibility of. So there is no question of individuality. This is the statement of authority. Now, apart from statement of authority, you have to apply your reasons and arguments. Oh. <clears throat> Can you say uh, anywhere there is agreement between two parties? No. Go study in the state or in the family, in the community, in the nation, there is no agreement. Uh, even in the assembly, even in your, your country, uh, suppose there is synod, everyone has got country's interest, but he is thinking in his individual way. One is thinking that my country's welfare will be in this line. Otherwise, why there is competition during election of president? Everyone is saying that oh, America needs Nixon. And another president, he also says, America needs me. Yeah. So, but why too? If America needs you, or you are both and so no, there is individuality. Mr. Nixon's opinion is something else, Mr. Another. A uh, candidate's opinion is something else. In the assembly, in the Senate, in the Congress, in the United Nations, everyone is fighting with his individual view. Ah. Otherwise, why there are so many flags in the world? You cannot say anywhere impersonality. Personality is predominating everywhere. Everywhere, the personality, individuality is predominant. So we have to accept. We have to apply our reason, arguments, and accept the authority. Then the question is solved. Otherwise, it will be difficult. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna.